I got a lot of respect and admiration for people who um, persevere through shit, you know. Like, I don't really have much time for someone who gives it a go for six months or a year and then gives up. It's like, well, fuck, you're never going to get anywhere, you know. Like, yeah. if you hit a couple of roadblocks and then that happens, so... But yeah, the, the people that make it are the people that keep going regardless of what happens. <laughs> Finished school, I started recording like my friends' bands, um, my own bands, and that sort of stuff. Practiced it for a while until I got good enough to charge people for it, and then I basically, yeah, just started charging people small amounts, doing it more and more and more to the point where I could quit all my other jobs and just do that. Mm -hmm. And then I moved into this place about six years, five, six years ago. Yeah, been here ever since. Working hard and not expecting much in return, I think, is the biggest thing. Um, I think a lot of people get into this industry expecting to make a lot of money straight away or, you know, to have all their bills paid as soon as they start working and basically having a return um, in a very short amount of time. But this industry is heavily based on reputation. It's um, the people that make it put in a lot, a lot of hours, like way more than they're paid to do. Um, it's something I only learnt like about halfway through, maybe even like more recently, that it is something that you need to, um, you need to be, be prepared to work a lot more than you're gonna be paid to do. Um, and I think that's the difference between someone who's passionate about what they're doing and someone who's just in it for money or whatever. The best answer to that question would just be um, working your ass off and not expecting anything in return. It's very competitive and it's also um, mostly unrewarding for most people, like uh, whether that be emotionally or fiscally. Um, I think depending on what part of the music industry that you wanted to get into, I think the biggest thing is um, excelling at your craft, whether, whatever that is, like whether it be record music or filming or um, playing an instrument or whatever. I think the biggest thing is um, understanding what you're doing and trying to be as good at that as you can. A lot of people just jump in um, and try and run before they can walk. Um, so yeah, like a lot of people ask me like, oh, how did I get into this? Or like, how do I get better at it? And it's always the same response. It's always just practice, just do it all the time. Like, how else are you gonna become a fast runner? Run every day. Like, you know, there's, there's no other way around it. People are like, oh, I want the quick, tricks and the sort of, like there's none like you've just got to do it all the time um particularly with this job where it's it's really about training your ears it's it's not about like figuring out how to learn gear or like you know um getting the big tricks from the big guys like those dudes are really good because they've spent years and years training their ears to understand what they're listening for and how to get what they've got to where they want it to be um so I, I think it's the same with playing drums too, you know, like anyone can sit down and, and bash a pair of sticks, um, but unless you understand what you're doing, what you want to do and how to get there, it's like, it's pointless. Um, yeah, practice, practice is everything, man, you know, just doing it all the time. Um, no excuses, just putting in the hours. <laughs> friends.